Hey, walk through the decades here on the highest Utica campus in the Bobby G. Cooper Fine Arts Building, a Black History program was held today to celebrate Black History Month. Black History Month was first proposed by the Black Educators and the Black United Students at Kent State University in February 1969, proposed marking at a time of honor African Americans and raise awareness of Black History. An African American historian named Carter G. Woodson found a week that focused a celebration of accomplishments of African Americans. He decided on a week in February because two important men were born in that month. Dean of Students, Ms. Sherry Alexander, tell me what made her host this event. Well, just a part of the Dean of Students, one of our duties is to make sure our students are informed about various topics. And so black history is very near and dear to us here at the Utica campus because we are a historically black college and university. So therefore, we had to start this month off on the right foot. We learn about our history. Vice President of CTE, Sherry Bellman, tells me how it's important for this history program to be taught. Because I, I don't think we do enough of it to reflect on not just the past, but also the present and the future where we're trying to go. But like I said, at the same time, you need to be living history and making sure you're being included in that each and every day. So it's very important. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Ms. Utica, Jada Henderson tells me how does it feel to have a speaking part in this event. Black History programs in high school, and I've never had like the nostalgia that I had today with the students. So I feel like I made a difference, and I was able to touch on a movement. In a College Utica campus continues to shed the light by celebrating Black History Month. The Mayor's Mayor reporter for WHUC, News 7.